Targeting Stian Bus uh, turned out to be very technical and um, it was quite relevant to see how you had to match your tackle to the type of fishing that we were doing. And luckily enough, Berkeley have just come out with a fantastic rod called the, the Berkeley Venom Anaconda. Uh, it's a 15 foot rod specifically designed for light tackle edible fishing. Although you can catch very big fish on it, it's a pleasure to fish with such a beautiful rod. It's based on the Berkeley Air technology. Now the Berkeley Air was one of those rods that were, were they defined spinning in the beginning. They defined grinder fishing. And with that technology, they've just taken it and put it into a bigger rod, and it's creating the same action and giving us the same result. Ooh, nice. yeah, that's it. Woo! <laughs> Wow, we finally got him. Beautiful skin. Yeah. Got a little bit tangled up here with the with the lines, but Woohoohoo! Hey! Wow. It's been amazing because uh, myself and Darren have been hunting these fish this morning. We couldn't find the right bank. And we both spotted this one. It was just fluffing on the back and uh, rolling through. And it's amazing how you can just fish an area and not find fish and you find the right zone and on daddy! <laughs> We're just fighting this fish as lightly as possible because it looks like myself and Darren have, um, have tangled a little bit and I'm fishing with uh, 20 pound that Berkeley Whiplash 8. I'm just worried that uh, with it being tangled there's a good possibility of us uh, parting off so just going to take my time and hopefully it'll sort itself out it's one of the good things about this uh, this Berkeley anaconda the tip is so sensitive that with the head nods of the fish you just hold the rod up keep the line tight and let the tip of the rod play the fish oops not head nods this fell yeah but that's the problem it's so much Fun fishing with light tackle. You know, you feel everything. You feel the every little head nod. Fish takes a lot of line. It's very powerful. It's such a fun way of fishing. It really, really is. Oh, 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 Jesus. Oh, that was hair raising because it's when you get a braided line rubbing together, it's not the best. And also, if you've got a little snoot of. Um, a mono against the braid. The braid can burn through the mono and that's uh, after us trying so hard to find a fish like this. <laughs> that would be very sad. Okay, well we fought this fish over the back bank and it's in the shore break. And uh, oh, just <laughs> holding on here, <laughs> it's nerve wracking. Fishing with such light gear, you know. And it's uh, just temperamental, small looks, very technical fishing. I just got to get this fish out. It's, uh, for me, it's an amazing uh, experience. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yes, please! Well, one of the reasons why we fish with these uh, little fusion hooks is because they're so strong, but also it catches it right in the corner of the mouth. Little 3 0 fusion hook. Well, uh, this is exactly all the things that I worry about fishing on this trip is this is what I've come for, this uh, Steeny. This is the one. Thank you, my boy. <laughs> Jeez! Ah oh, man, I'm super chuffed. Let's get a, a quick photo and get him back in the water. Well, uh, this is an absolute privilege, I tell you. Oh, Darren uh, said the conditions were right today. And uh, we got him. Can't ask for much more than that. This is uh, my boy. I'm very, very chuffed. Let's get him back. This is a beautiful fish. Whew. It's always good uh, to give them a bit of life first. Just hold them in the water, 
fighting quite strong. Here he comes. Hey! Ha! Hi. Pen, let the battle begin.